PI Nation, what's going on? It's Kevin DeHaven. Hey, we're going to run you through a full leg workout today. We're going to show you uh, all the exercises. Right now, we're starting off with lying leg curls. It's a very slow, deliberate, two second pause at the top and a hard contraction. You watch Cornelius here. These aren't rushed reps. Slow control with contraction, very hard contraction at the top. First exercise. All right, so we did three warm up sets, about uh, 10 to 15, 12 to 15 reps. Now we're doing three working sets. 8 to 10 reps. Again, slow and controlled. Pull, pause. Really contract the hamstring. Back down. Three working sets, 8 to 10 reps. All right, so the next exercise we're doing is single leg leg curls. Now look, we're doing hamstrings first for two reasons. One is, those of you who actually train legs probably don't train hamstrings hard enough. So putting hamstrings first in the uh, workout definitely will help you focus a lot more attention and energy on the hamstrings. The second reason is doing hamstrings prior to quads is like doing biceps before doing triceps. It's only going to warm up the knee joint and it's really going to help overall with the entire workout. It's not going to take anything away from your, your quad workout. So make sure you make, hit the hams hard and a good four to eight sets uh, each exercise. We did two exercises for hamstrings. Now we're moving on to a pretty unique piece of equipment. This is a hammer strength leg press. I don't know how many of you guys have this, but you can use any leg press. So we're going to do 15 to 20 reps, again, slow and controlled, progressively working up to a heavier weight, and we'll show you a couple of those sets when we get there. All right, so look, we're starting to go a little bit heavier here. We have four plates aside. But pay attention to how Cornelius is doing these reps. Slow, controlled, really focusing on the contracting the quads, and he's got a certain level of intensity where he's moving this weight and really concentrating on what he's doing. Good. Good. Let's go. Lightweight. Come on. Good. All right, so we did two warm-up sets, four working sets, all eight to 12 reps. Now the final set, we're going to do a drop set, and that'll be it for this exercise. Make sure on your last set, set or two of your heavier exercises, you absolutely take that stuff to failure. You can do drop sets, uh, super sets, but in the end, definitely, at least a few sets in the workout take to absolute failure. And now we're gonna do a super set that I've talked about before. This is one of my favorites. Half squat, super set of leg extensions. This super set always delivers. No matter what I'm doing, what other exercise I do with it, I always get insanely sore in my entire quadricep from doing this combination. So we're gonna do four sets of supersets right here, uh, 10 to 15 reps on each. All right, so to recap the workout, we did four working sets of lying leg curls, very slow, controlled, two second pause at the top, after about three or four warm ups. Then we did single leg, leg uh, curls, same, same way, big stretch at the bottom, holding at the top, we did three sets of those. Then we did the hammer strength leg press, two warm up sets, four working sets. The fifth set was a drop set. Very uh, intense, nasty set to failure. Then we went over to the hack squat machine and super set of hack squats and leg extensions. We did four of those. So four hacks, super set with the leg extensions. And then we're finishing up with a one-legged leg press, leg high. You come down, really focuses on your glutes and your hams. Drive all the way up and squeeze. And it will uh, also work your quads as well. But really a lot, of, a lot of tension and emphasis on the hams and the glutes on this one here. So give that a shot. 
It's about 20, 22 sets, I think, altogether. I think you'll like it.